very resilient kid, though. He's he's always happy. <laughs> you pretty much do anything you want to him, and he's he's smiling and having fun. Mark Hodge was joined by his wife Angela and their 15-year-old son Dustin. They say Dustin loves going to school every day. Dustin has Down syndrome, and he also has autism, and very loving, very funny. But on March 1st, something at school left his parents shaken. Police say a teacher and a teacher's aide restrained Dustin by taping him to a chair. One of them recorded it on her cell phone. I saw his arms down to his side, and he was completely taped from his arms around his waist, around the back of the chair, around back around the front, and his arms were, he could move his hands at the bottom, and that was it. His parents say Dustin is not very verbal, and this took away his ability to communicate. You hold his hands, and it's like putting a piece of tape over somebody's mouth. Uh, that's how he expresses himself. He's constantly moving his hands. His parents say the video shows Dustin begging someone to come over and cut the tape. He doesn't like to be restrained in any way, and if you restrain him, he he starts kind of freaking out. Both staff members told police they did it not as punishment, but as a joke. It's disgusting how they were laughing at him. It's you know for for their own their own fun to get kicks. Police have charged the now former staff members Allison Vestring and Rachel Smith with misdemeanor unlawful restraint. You entrust your, your kid to go to school and to be taught, not to be teased. That trust put into teachers every day by parents is forever shaken for the Hodges. Definitely a little bit harder to send him to school knowing that that happened to him. If you wouldn't want it done to your kids, don't do it to someone else's kids. Hey there, yeah, you could stop watching right now, but let's be honest, you don't want to do that. Hit the links or click subscribe to see more amazing content from all of us here at Local 12.